Hey everybody, it's your pal Ron Howard from Extreme Sequences, and this is Monday Minute. Last week we talked about different ways that we could move these effects around by selecting them both, right-clicking, and choosing the alignment feature. And we looked at start times and end times and both times. But there's also a another one called center points and where this might be kind of cool is if you've got one of your effects that's slightly longer on the front and back end of the effect but you want them to line up in the center uh, that's really simple to do you select them both remember the one you want it to match to is the one you select last right click alignment center points Boom, done, simple, simple, okay? If you don't like that and wanna put them back, you can still do all the same things, alignment, both time center points, match duration, shift the line start times. But today, I wanna show you a couple things you can do that's a little bit different as well. And that is if we have these aligned together or not, we can hold down the uh, command key or control key, and we can start using shortcut commands on the keyboard. If I hit the left arrow, it just simply moves it over to the spot. If I hit the left arrow again on the bottom one only, it moves it all the way over. Let's select both of these. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to command or control shift and the right arrow, watch what it does. It stretches it to each timing mark. I'll do control Z, control Z. If I do the command arrow without the shift, it scoots it way, way over. So maybe be careful with that, right? So if I do the command one arrow over, it does it one at a time. Pretty cool, right? Let's do that again. Let's put you back. Let's grab both. And we're gonna do the command arrow they're both selected. You can see they're blue. Command arrow. Cool, right? Command shift and then the back left arrow. And we can get it to go all the way to the front. That's pretty cool stuff. Now we've got these guys here that are sitting out in no man's land uh, for the cubes from Gilbert Engineering. And we'd like them to match up as well. So we will simply click this one, this one, and either one of these. And now we can do the right click, alignment, adjust both times. It's just that fast. So I hope you folks are taking advantage of these cool little nifty features and next slides that you may not be thinking about that are afterthoughts. That's it. That's my Monday Minute. You guys have a great week. See ya.